Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? Check out rockbinalcoins.com for the cheapest and fastest coins anywhere. Use code ZERK for 15% off your order. And if you guys want to compete in tournaments for cash prizes, make sure to check out tourneycrypt.com. What's going on guys? It's Zerx coming at you today with another YouTube video and today we have got the new legends currently in the game and we actually have got 93 overall set legends and a 94 overall LTD. So the LTD is actually Matt Burke who was the, I guess the team diamond I want to say, the team diamond for the Viking Center. He's a 94 overall. We also got Andre Reed and the cornerback for the Dolphins. I cannot remember his name. It's not Sam Madison. I think it's Sertain, I want to say it is. I believe he is the 93 overall set legend. So those are the legends for today. I don't want to see if the sets are actually up. It looks like the sets are not up, which is always weird. Like the packs will be up and you can actually pull the players. But the sets this year have just always been like a minute or two late. So it's a little bit weird. Legend Fantasy Packs, though, should be in the store. You guys can see they currently are in the store. And, of course, if you guys want to see more pack make sure you drop a like on the video. It does help me out. And hit that sub button down below. We've got eight Legend Fantasy Packs going to get into, though. Let's go ahead and start this off. Now... This is actually really cool. I love that they're increasing the overalls. Now, this doesn't just mean for Legends. Since they're increasing the overalls on Legends, guys, this means everything else is going to increase, too. So, flashbacks, heavyweights, veterans, they should, I think, at least, uh, be going up by one this upcoming week. So, that's very, very nice. And taking a look at everything, I actually checked back because I know people are going to ask me, you know, when is the Harvest promo? I looked back at last year. I believe it came out six days before Thanksgiving, which means... It should be coming out this upcoming Friday as well. So be on the lookout for the Harvest Browns. Again, the league here, 82 overall, Keenan Allen, and an 80 81. 80 overall, Jonathan Jones there, not too bad. Round number three, start off with the base elite. Okay, we get 85, that's not bad, actually. Uh, team of the week elite here, 82, that's not good. I got a feeling, though, we're going to get a big X right here. Ah, oh, didn't get there. We get 85, Jim Brown, so I'm going to go ahead take the 85 overall Jim Brown there. Now, Andre Reed honestly does not look that bad. I may actually pick him up. If you guys want to see gameplay, let me know. Comment down below Andre Reed gameplay, and maybe I'll knock some gameplay out for you guys later today as well. Seven more Legend Fantasy Packs to get into, though. Let's see just how good these packs are going to be. Last week, they were pretty solid. Round two, we get a power of Michael Vick. Okay, I would have rather had the uh, series Redux Michael Vick, though. 79, Jakeem Grant. And Team of the Week, possibly Elite. 80 overall, James Crowder. That's what I'd like to see. Round number three, it's going to be an 86. 86, Derek Wolf there. We get a... Okay, 86. 86. This is going to be in the 86 overall pack. No, it's not! 89, Andre Reed. That's a big time pull, especially since I want to actually get his set done. That definitely just saved me a lot of coins. 89, Andre Reed. 87 speed, 87 catch traffic, 87 spectacular catch. Reed actually does look pretty solid. I'll say I don't really think that the Dolphins cornerback looks that great, but Andre Reed, I think, looks pretty dang solid. Next Legend Fantasy Pack here. We actually do get a power of Andrew Lux. That's pretty nice. Round two. By the way, if you guys haven't seen my lineup update video that I did yesterday, or in general, any of the videos I did yesterday, make sure you guys check it out. I made a ton of changes to the lineup. Round three, we get an 86 Alejandro Vanuit, which he has a power up. Okay. We get a heavyweight player here. 90 Ben Jones. That's a really good pull. So unless we get a big legend, which we did not, we're going to go with that 90 overall Ben Jones. That's actually a really good pull. I don't even know, like, how good a stats Ben Jones has. 86 pass block, 80 overall. That's not bad. For a 90 overall center, not too bad at all. Now... There is like one more change I can make to my team, and that'd be Dan Dudor for right tackle, which currently is series redux is down to 400k. But I feel like there's gotta be a better right tackle coming out soon. So I really don't want to pick up Dan Dudorf and then have to like sell him back in like a week or two if we get some new right tackle for the Harvest Prompts. Kind of why I'm a little bit like uh, not not really like going full blown uh, for getting Dan Dudorf because he is so cheap. We get 86 OBJ. We also get 88 Keith Bullock. So that's a really good pack. Can we get another big X? We do. 91 Shannon Sharp. Let's go, man. 91 overall Shannon Sharp. There's so we got a full legend. 91 Shay Sharp. I will definitely take that. Four more legend fantasy packs remaining. We got a big piece for Andre Reed, and we got that full legend Shannon Sharp. 
I'll take it. I'll take another full legend though if you want to throw one of those at me. Round one here, we actually get a couple gold. Go to the 65. Round two. Okay, we get a legend piece. 81 and a veteran. That's gonna be like an 84, 85. Or an 86 Buster Screen. I guess I'll take I think it's Buster Screen. Uh, round three. Okay, we get a low legend piece to start 85. We actually need four legend pieces this round. One's gonna be big. Wow, none are big. Alright, that sucks. Uh, so yeah, Patrick Sertain, we're going to take him. 86 overall. Alright, that was kind of a, a not so good pack. But we got three more of Fantasy Packs remaining. We'll see what we can do. Also, I've been playing Weekend League. I actually, uh, I've been doing, like, just recording. Basically, while I play, if you guys know, I basically just play, like, a bunch of Weekend League games in a row uh, whenever I play. So, I don't tend to do, like, live commentaries, but I did get a pretty dang good gameplay. At 88, Aaron Donald! Okay! <laughs> All right, Aaron Donald, round number two. I did not see that coming. Uh, I will definitely be taking you in a power of J.J. Watt. All right. Round three, that's a heck of a pull. 85 Jason Kelsey, flashback player. 89 Landon Collins, and... Oh, crap, I did not expect Big X. 88 John Elway. That's a good pull. We're going to go to 89 Landon Collins. That was potentially our best pack there. We got Aaron Donald and we got Landon Collins. Packs are on fire this morning. But like I was saying, I got a pretty dang good uh, weekly gameplay. I'll probably post that sometime this week, maybe tomorrow, maybe sometime throughout the week. But uh, it's going to be post-commentary. If you guys enjoy seeing the weekly gameplays and you're okay with it being post-commentary, I know some people don't like post coms but when I'm sitting here playing like 10, 12 weekly games at a time, I'm not going to be live comming all of them in a row. That's just, that's ridiculous. Round three here, we get 85 overall Le'Veon Bell. We also get 90 Lawrence Taylor. Holy crap, these packs are hot. And we also get 89 Michael Strahan. Holy crap. Dude. Two full legends in one pack. That is insane. Shout out, shout out to the, the voice crack, the voice crack king. Uh, we get Lawrence Taylor at 90 overall. Wow, these packs are insane. This is this maybe like one of my best legend fantasy pack bundles yet. Uh, except when we pulled LTD Grind. If we can get a limited time pull, by far and away the best bundle that we have open. Let's see, 72, 71, 70, round two. Well, we get power up JJ Watt again. And we also get a power-up at Reeves. I guess I'll take both the power-ups. Round three, we get a football center player. 86, Richie, okay. 82. Let me end it off good. End it off good. End, uh, we did not end it off amazing. But we got 86 overall, Andre Reed. Honestly, that bundle was very, very good. So let's go ahead, get into this 86-plus Legends player topic. We ended off with a full Legend. We pulled Flashback Landing Collins. We pulled... Uh, Aaron Donald. We pulled full legend Shannon Sharp, full legend Lawrence Taylor. This bundle was incredible. Can we end it off with something good? 92 Dallas Clark. Holy crap. Yeah, this bundle was amazing. That was an absolutely insane bundle. Let's see how many coins we just made off that. That is ridiculous. Okay, so just off the elite, you guys can see. Uh, we started off with Jim Brown, I believe, and maybe Keenan. I think Jim Brown is probably the first lead we pulled. So Jim Brown, we already know, is like 20K. Andre Reed, 89 overall. He's 125,000 coins. I'm going to hold on to him and just do a set uh, for a little bit cheaper. I also got Ben Jones with another 120K. So we're already at 245K, plus we add all these elites right here. I mean, we're at like 265 or so. Shannon Sharp is 160 so we're already over 420,000 coins marcus allen is probably like what 15 yeah about about 15,000 coins so we're at 435k buster is 60k holy crap i, I don't think he's going that much uh, i'm gonna say so we are 465 i'll say we're just at 500 i, I don't think he actually goes 65k so 500 plus 45k 545,000 coins and then we got landon collins on top of that so 545 plus 80, we're already over 620,000 coins. We easily made a million coins, I think. 625 plus 70, so we're looking at almost 700K. Also 700K for the Eddie Goldman. Lawrence Taylor is 170, so we're looking at 870K. Then we also got 86 Andre Reed, which is 40K. We're over 900,000 coins. And then we got Dallas Clark, which he is currently going for 200K. 1.1 million coins after tax boys that is 1 million hot coins and that's not to mention all the power-ups and all the goals we got 100 percent made over a million coins of that bundle so that was honestly an incredible bundle man we got what three full legend pulls uh aaron donald a landon collins that was 
a good, good bundle right there. That was that was really good. Uh, I'm definitely gonna go ahead though and uh, get that Andre Reed done potentially if you guys want to see the gameplay. Let's see his stats though, right? He should be up by now. And yeah, there's so Andre Reed right now is currently going for what 500k. About 400k. It's not that bad, honestly. So let's take a look here. 93 overall Andre Reed. 93 overall Andre Reed has got 91 speed, 91 jumping, 90 catching, 92 catching traffic, 91 spectacular catch, 92 short, 86 medium, 84 deep. If you guys know me, you know I like to have someone with good catching traffic usually. But if they have spec catch, that's a bonus right there, which Andre Reed does. Uh, he's also got 90 acceleration. His run blocking is a 53. He's also got a spin and juke of 83 and 87 with 76 stiff arm. This is an all-around really, really solid card, honestly. Like, I actually really like this Andre Reed card. Uh, more than likely going to get gameplay with him. We also have got Patrick Sertain. Maybe it's certain. I don't really know. He's got 91 speed. He's got 91 excel, 91 agility, 87 play rec, or 87 jumping, 91 play rec, 92 man, 86 zone. He's more of a man coverage type of cornerback, but uh, with the right cams, you can get him over in 90 zone coverage as well. He's got 73 catch, which is really good. Uh, he's got an 87 jumping. His block shed... Is a 51, which is actually pretty solid, and his hit power as well is 63. It's not a terrible card, not the best cornerback in the game, but it's definitely not a terrible card at all. And we've got the LTD, which he is actually a 94 overall center. Matt Bird going for 1.5 million coins. That's a lot of coins. Travis Frederick, 91 strength, 93 awareness, 91 pass blocking. He's got 91 run block. Definitely looks like a very good card with 68 speed, 78 excel. The speed is where he destroys Travis Frederick in. So definitely is the better center strictly just off the speed. I mean, you can get to that second level a lot, lot quicker with Matt Burke. But with that being said, guys, those are the new legends for today. That bundle was absolutely incredible. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure you drop a like on the video. And of course, hit that sub button down below. And if you guys watched all the way until the end, comment down below. Let's think here. Zerk Squad. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.